Okay, so lots of people have been wondering how to get custom flags in Kerbal Space Program 2. And I'm going to tell you right now that it can be done with mods. Dead easy, just a little bit more complicated than it was in KSP 1. Let's do this. Go into Steam, right click KSP 2, Properties, Local Files, Browse. And here we are in our KSP 2 install directory. We're going to copy that uh, kind of uh, root there. Go to the internet, go to spacedoc.info, okay? Click Kerbal Space Room 2, find the mod that says Space Warp, click that, download it, and then paste the, what you just copied there to get straight to your install location, save. Great, let's go back to our install. Uh, we're going to open up the zip file, uh, tell WinRAR we don't want to buy it, select everything, drag and drop, and there we are. We can close that, and we can delete this. Then we want to launch KSP2 EXE. By the way, side tutorial, this is how you skip the uh, private division launcher. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Wait for all of this. Okay, there. Now we can just go Alt F4. Now that should have created a mods folder in Space Warp, which is great. Now we're going to go in there, and then we're going to go back to spe uh, Space Dock, back and find the mod that says Custom Flags. We want to download that, and we're going to put it in that folder that appeared, the mods folder. Click there, save, all done. Back here, open WinRAR. So we don't want to buy it. Custom flags, drag and drop. Perfect. And that's it. The only thing need to left. Uh, the only thing <laughs> needed to do now. Go back to the main KSP2 install location. New folder. Just call it flags. And then that's where you drag and drop your flag files. So here's one I made earlier. My classic Lown Aerospace Ooh, logo. There, very blurry at this res uh, this blown up size. Uh, the resolution you need is 512 by 300 pixels. That's the uh, size, and save it as a PNG. Now we're going to see if all of this worked, and uh, I didn't just completely mess up this tutorial. Let's go. Right, let's go. Single player. We're going to start a new campaign. We're going to make it normal difficulty. Lown Aerospace 2. La I still don't really know the difference between these two things. Lown Aerospace. And then, disable page. Ah, uh, we have a custom flag. Let's set the colors. See done. Let's start the campaign because you know <clears throat> we've got a logo for our um, campaign. We want to make sure it's a placeable flag, though, right? Let's go. Let's go and let's go and find out. Right. Let's just jump to uh, the runway straight away. Uh, we'll just launch the flea. Whatever. <laughs> let's go, Bill Kerman. We can jump off. Oh, I love the sound of the footsteps. Plant the flag. Test. Stay with the UI for maximum cinematic enjoyment. Boom. And there we, there we have it. There's the. That's how you install mods in KSP2. And that's how you install this particular mod, the Custom Flags mod. So uh, thank you to the people who made the mod. Uh, let's just alter for... Because you guys have seen this now. Uh, there we are. Thank you to... Adams Sogum and uh, Space Warp, which is made by Cheese three six six zero and X six zero six. They are top top people, my favorite people. Uh, thank you for watching this rapid fire tutorial. Pfft.